y'all. In the morning, some crazy news right now. It seems that little Wayne is in critical condition and he's in the hospital. And a lot of people are saying that they don't know how much longer, you know, they're going to be able to keep him in the state. He was found unconscious in his hotel room, they say. So whatever that entails, um, I'd like to know what that means now. I got to go out of there and, you know, as he's still in critical condition, I pray for his well-being and that a lot of different people get involved. Um, they're alleging it's over his lean issues that he's been having. Um, the longevity of that weighed heavy on his body. It took a toll on his system because of the pro methazine that's present in that liquid mixture. Um, adding it to the soda, Dirty Sprite. Uh, we've also seen another MC go out of the game like this. And his name was Pimp C, a legend in the South, down in Texas. So it seems very synonymous to the same thing where they're both alleging in these situations these individuals who were stars and sort of had control over themselves to an extent of doing these things for a long time, you would assume or presume that they know how to control the amounts. But it's crazy that they're saying they found him unconscious. Um, you know, I hope that everything goes well. You know, I hope, uh, I pray for, for his uh, well-being, you know. Um, this is crazy because it doesn't look good. This is his third or fourth time that they're saying it, which also I read an article that I'm going to get checked out. I don't know for detail, but was alleging that, um, the Os Osama theory, whereas little Wayne has been succumbed to this lean issue but m people were talking about it like he was still alive so behind the scenes he was actually gone the whole time but now they're bringing it out trying to act like it's happening now so that would be an even bigger issue if that hit the fan which it probably would not but as I get this checked out that's a very objective view to take that you know because if you remember about a year ago in January of either 2015 or 2016, there was the release of him um, going for the second time. Um, if I'm not mistaken, the plane incident at the beginning of this year was the third. Um, it had been a long time before this second time. And when that second time happened, there was an immediate news release that alleged something had succumbed to Lil Wayne, but then it came back out and cleared its statements up saying that wasn't true. I don't know what's going on. I don't know who's around him. To have the money, the private chef and different things, his health should be being taken care of. He should have the utilities he needs to be producing music and stay healthy. Especially having people like Drake and them around him, you would think that he would have the influences and stuff, but something that alarmed me is Drake got an arm mural tattoo of Little Wayne before we're even seeing him in this situation where he's gone. So was this known he was in this situation? Was there more issues or deeper implications? Because we didn't see a lot of public public appearances by Little Wayne for a while, and we're not really sure what all of this uh, does ultimately mean. But you know, one thing I want to say is there's a lot of illustrious lifestyles that are lived with this fame that's bolstered, that's bigged up. And ultimately, a lot of it is so dark that it leads you to your end because you live life like a renegade. And so you get a renegade's end. So ultimately, no one could ever take Little Wayne out. He took himself out. Like, with the issues and different things he's experienced with himself and this addiction that he worked through. I'm most angry at all the people that were around 
that didn't look at a friend and reach out to say, look, we got you. Stop this. I'm going to hold you down. I know Birdman and him were having issues. I don't know what's going to happen with that. All I know is he has one of the largest catalogs in the world. So potentially, if anything does happen to him, you will see that Birdman now is the prime owner of Lil Wayne's material. And that worth is going to be beyond anything we've seen for any artist in the rap game. Even for Big Papa, Lil Wayne's resume and everything he stands for is going to be too, like, too large and too vast for people to even combat. Um, I also heard Os other Osama theories, and I'll begin to go into those as time goes on. But I thank you guys for rocking with your boy, you know, always being here, supporting. I do appreciate it. I have more material coming. Um, this was just a breaking news story. I had the link below. You know how I rock. All rights reserved.